Well, that boy's fast, man. That boy got turbo in his ass or something, bro. I'm here with Devon Moore. You know what, I'm gonna do it like this, cause I did it for Leary, you know what I'm saying, in Orlando. I was like, I'm here with Christian Leary, the fastest motherfucker in Orlando. So I'm gonna do it for, <laughs> for Mortal, you know what I'm saying? I'm here with Devon Mortar, man, the fastest motherfucker in South Florida, you know what I'm saying? You, 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 you eventually start getting recruited by a lot of people, yeah. and you commit to Florida State. Why you commit to Florida State? That was my dream school, dream school. What the hell happened now? <laughs> um, <laughs> I wasn't like when it got close to signing day. Uh -huh. I wasn't really feeling it. Like I was really like looking at like watching football. Like me, I'm a person. I'm gonna watch football and see what's going on. And I ain't really too much see the ball being thrown around. So that we that that's when West Virginia and Louisville came in the picture. Right. I told Coach Tate like I need another home. So he told me to just. You no, know, stay committed just in case things don't go right. So I went on a visit to West Virginia and Louisville, but I loved it. Louisville scheme. I loved how they use their receiver, especially a fast receiver like me. Yeah. So that made me flip. They was always there? Um, yeah. Or they, they just started coming harder yeah, at Louis, the end. Louisville was there. Huh? They was there. Because now that I think about it, when we tuned in, we didn't know. We thought you was going to commit to Florida State. Like, now that I think about it, you know what I'm saying? Everybody thought you was going to commit to Florida State. Yeah. And you made a decision to, to how, how close was it to signing day? It was like a week before signing day. Yeah? That week before I came back from um, Louisville. Mm -hmm. I came back from Louisville, and then I already knew in my mind I was going to sign in Louisville. How many times you had to count on your hand, they mentioned Tutu Atwell to you? Mm. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> You could be the next two twat well, dog. You be when you look light skinned than you, but you could be the next. I know they probably said that to you a billion times. Yeah. But the the fact of the matter is, is man, it's it's true. It's it's true. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes a special person just need an opportunity, and you walk in the wrong door, and that shit can get shut down. You know what I'm saying? Two twat well went to the place where they're gonna give him an opportunity, and he did exactly what I think you you're gonna do. You know what I'm saying? Devon, um, listen, bro. You're feared, dog. You're feared across of uh, Dave and Broward. Um, uh, did you know that? Nah. Nah? Nah, no shit. Yeah, because shorties don't really come out and say shit like that. They just talk shit on the ground, huh? <laughs> <laughs> when, you, when you started playing football? Then? You started playing your football where? I started playing at a lot of hair Broncos at West Kenlock Park. How, how, like, uh, how old did you start playing? I started playing when I was seven. And you played all the way up? Yeah. What position you were? I played running back, actually. You were little, though, weren't you? Yeah. Um, you was good? Yeah, I was good. What's the most touchdown you ever scored? Most touchdowns I scored in one season was 22. And then I rushed in the morning. Mm hmm Yeah. <clears throat> Listen, so you committed to Louisville, right? Because I don't know how the letter and tents and all that stuff work, right? You know what I'm saying? So how, you committed to Louisville, right? So you signed the letter and tent, and you know what I'm saying? You on, you on board with Louisville. Um, only reason I'm saying this is because the Miami fan in me really believes that Miami needs some speed. You know what I'm saying? Is you could you get out of that, or is there options to get out of that, or um, do you know how it even work? No, I don't know. You how don't I even work. know how it works. I don't know how it works. No, nah, because you're gonna be riding with the people who's yeah. riding with you. Yeah. But listen, man, I'm here. I'm gonna come tell. You, I'm gonna tell you this. I sit up here every day and I talk and I laugh and I joke. You know what I'm saying? Um, but as men. I have two daughters that I never get to see, and I'm fighting for them. You know what I'm saying? But when I, as men, sometimes we gotta just go. We gotta go and go go for our goals. You know what I'm saying? You just carry that with you as you headed to where you're going. You know what I'm saying? I'm here to tell you this, bro. Like, just keep going. You know what your passion is. You know what you're good at. Do it. All right. Appreciate you, bro. Fast motherfucking South Florida.